Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. And today I am trying out a new makeup line. Um, it's not like technically new, but it's new to me. I've shopped with um, Shop Miss A before and I've got accessories from them. But this time I purchased their makeup and I got this look using all Shop Miss A's um, products as well as the brushes. So if you want to see how I actually got this look, I want you to keep on watching. Okay, so today I am going to be trying out some makeup from shopmissa.com. It's a more price website. And I've never tried any of their makeup. And um, I've shopped from them before, but I decided to try the makeup. So we're going to try this makeup out and see if we can get a cute look from the Shop Miss A makeup. So let's start with the items that I got from those sites. I got um, four foundations. They did not have my color. So they have two different brands. So I got two in this brand. Uh oh. And then two in this brand. So we're going to try to mix them up, make a concoction to get my perfect shade. I also got the concealers. Let me just dump everything out of this bag. So I also got concealer. The liquid concealer. This one right here. Um, as well as a shimmer and glow bronzer. I got a makeup sponge, a fan brush, a concealer brush. So I got I got everything girls to do a perfect look from them. I also got a different uh, amber, a darker concealer. So I got two concealers. Um, I got a lipstick, a foundation brush, a white uh oh, a white um, eyeliner for the bottom line. I like to put one there. I got an eyebrow palette for the eyebrows. And I got setting powder. They didn't have a spray, so I didn't get a spray from them. At least I don't think I did. Nope, I didn't get a spray. I don't see a setting spray. So they didn't have a setting spray. And I also got their 3D Fox Mink Lashes. Alright, so I'm not going to keep on talking. Let's just jump right into this makeup look. I want to start by um, trying to match the foundation. I want to start with these two because this one is darker and this one is lighter. And I think that'll be easier for me to... I think that'll be easier for me to um, match it. To match my color. So let's see if we can get... A color I don't have any I got something I'll say I don't have any trays in here where I'm at but I got something so we're just gonna match those up and we're gonna see how this foundation from shop miss a works out I think the foundation was like three dollars I'm not really sure I don't remember but I did get it in pure beige and cappuccino so let's see cappuccino looks kind of dark so I got this nice foundation brush the brushes look nice they look really nice for under five dollars you can't beat it like when I said that the stuff was a reasonable price so see I have it in there in this little thing whatever it is eyelash container and I'm gonna mix that in see if I can get my color let's see I'm gonna mix it up a little bit more see normally I start with my eyebrows but today we're going to mix it up a little bit I think it's too light. What y'all think? Let me know. It's too light. But it feels good on the skin. It's feeling really good on my skin. It don't feel heavy. It's like really light. I 
now we can get some magic ore. Alright. I think I got it on there. And small disclaimer, like my face is itchy. Like it's an itchy burning feeling that I'm having right now. Like, so I hope I don't have like a breakout after this because honey I've been working on my skin I've been working on my skin and I will be pissed if this stuff break me up I like the coverage I do like I really like the coverage on this if I can get it to mix properly every time Miss A might be go to. Gotta get this in that hair line. Okay, I really like that. So now we're going to go in and do my brows. And I'm going to use the brow powder that I got from Shop Miss A. And it it has three colors on it. So I'm gonna use the darker one. Yeah, I'm gonna use the darker one. I like that. I'll see. So we're going to go in with the concealer to conceal these brows. I'm going to try the medium to full coverage amber concealer for the eyebrows. Oh no, that's like so dark. I'm gonna have to mix that. So that's the all right so you can see I have the eyebrows shaped out with the I, I had to go get my crayon case spoolie so let me just brush them out a little bit cuz I was not feeling that powder I'm like what the heck is going on I don't know why I didn't get a spoolie from um oh because I have too many I didn't need one okay so I'm going to use that same concealer to conceal the designer bags and I'm just gonna blend everything out and hopefully hopefully it works out Using this different brand of makeup is making me feel like, like I don't know how to do my makeup. And then nothing match and I have to, and I'm having to like color match everything on my own. I'm really not used to doing this. But I can say everything is like super, super duper full coverage because you can't even see my mole right now like sis is gone like where are you so I guess that's a good thing I guess that's like a really good thing that it is like super duper full coverage just to go around these edges because I feel like the concealer was too light because I mixed it too light I mixed that concealer wrong y'all want to know what the problem is I keep looking at myself because I put that foundation <laughs> I don't put that foundation on my lips I put that foundation on my lips and I'm like what the heck is wrong but everything is blending out fine it's just I put the dang gone foundation on my lips I'm 
Okay, my eyebrows are sisters today. They are not twins. This is like Amber and this is Sophia. They're like sisters with different daddies, okay? <laughs> but they got the same mama. <laughs> That's the best that these eyebrows is going to get. That's the best that this, this, it's just the best it's going to get. Also got like this glow liquid highlighter that I was supposed to mix with the foundation. So I want to put some of that on. Oh, that's a lot. Can y'all see the glow? I have to clean this foundation off my lips. I cannot keep looking at myself like that. Okay. That's so much better. That was horrible. It looked horrible. Alright, next I'm going to pop the eyelashes on. I do have on right now some individuals but I'm gonna pop these eyelashes on top maybe to give it a pow pow these eyelashes are kind of short they're thick they feel nice but they're not that long all right so I got the lashes on and if I do say so myself you can be the judge of that let me know those lashes are cute they are really really cute but they're tiny like they're tiny in length they're tiny in width they're just like super tiny like I said I have on some um individuals as well so maybe that's giving that that pow as well so your lashes won't look like this because I have on a whole nother set of lashes up under there all right so next I'm going to try out this um uh, liner pencil on my waterline it's a white one that liner went on very good I like that all right so I'm going to just make sure everything is blended out I'm going to go in with the I made a mess I made a big mess I want to go in with this how do I open this setting powder And it is per perfect setting powder. It's just banana. Just a banana powder. So it's like really yellow. So hopefully it don't give me like a flash or anything. I'm just because I've been trying to use all the Shop Miss A products. So I'm going with this this blender that I've been using. Y'all see how yellow that is? It's really yellow. Like lately I um, have been staring away from like the super bright setting powder because I fell in love with the setting powder that I got from um what is it? Oh she glam like oh shame on me because you guys know how much I love she glam I cannot think about it right now right then in here like, what the heck is the name I just said I was staring away from this light powder but look I'm taking it on So, I did not get any like lip liners, but I did get a lipstick. So, I got Carmelita. And it's like the color that I always wear, like a pink, pinkish red, like in the pink and red family. Almost my natural lip color. Just about. Mm -hmm. 
That smells good. That smells really good. All right, so I got a Sun Glow Shimmer Bronzer. And I am a bronzer girl. I love, love, love bronzer. Why every time? If y'all been watching my videos, y'all know. I'm always ending up with a broke brush. Like, why every time I want to buy some brushes, they end up broke? So hopefully this works for me to use it. <sighs> so I'm gonna brush this powder away. I gotta use another brush because all these other brushes is dirty. I'm gonna use some like crayon case brush to wipe that away. All right, so let's go in and shine bright like a diamond. Y'all know this is like my super duper favorite part. Did I use everything? I use everything. Is it shining? Now see, it's brown, but it's not coming off on this brush. All right, so I told you guys in the beginning of the video that they didn't have a setting spray. So I'm going to use my old faithful Urban Decay All Nighter to just give this whole face a set look. One, two, three. Let that dry. All right, one. All right, girls, this is the finished look. And I'm like, I'm so happy with this look. I think all together with all of the makeup that I purchased, I spent under $40 for all of that stuff. And to get like a full coverage look like this, you will have to spend some money on a good, a good, good, good brand of makeup. Like this is like a good coverage. Everything is covered. And I'm like happy with it and it looks good with this hair because this is the hair that I'm wearing for today. Like overall, I recommend you trying Shop Miss A's beauty line. I, I feel cute.